What's up guys? It's your boy, Andy Dylan Howano. And I've recently started development on a brand new hypersonic missile test bed known as the HSM Stratoguard Mark I, which is what will be shown in this video. Now we'll go ahead and say the missile has not been drag glitched and in the initial clip it's not even remotely complete. But I've already done a massive update to it to give it better flight performance and more speed and a higher payload. So what you see now is only a taste of what is to come. I've got a few plans for this missile. It will be a multi-role and I plan on building an aircraft chassis around this hypersonic missile and a boat chassis around the missile. And who knows, maybe it'll end up on the Finmeco Lancer 2 submarine as well. So the way it works is it uses a proxy suite, uh, which you can tell when it's active because I'll be in the first person cam as you see right now. Uh, during that time, there will be a scanning suite of distance sensors on the front as well as fixed sensors on the body. And whenever they get within range of a target, it will trigger a very specific blast sequence that basically turns this thing into an actual blast fragmentation warhead, which extends its range and damage radius. In fact, I've got it down to the point where it actually physically separates the missile mid-explosion. The force of the explosion from behind forces the forward warhead towards the target during detonation, so it actually can do pin from the front warhead during the detonation if it gets close enough to the target. This will make it exceptional against airborne targets and naval targets, and this will be an RC-controlled launched missile, so it will not have a name tag. 